Design thinking is a highly regarded methodology used in design, engineering, and business fields to promote innovation. As shown here, design thinking consists of seven interrelated phases. The first three are understand, explore, and define. These involve developing a deep understanding of the factors that impact a design with the vast bodies of scientific concepts that govern the natural world at the top of the list. In the technical videos, you'll see how Autodesk 3ds Max can help anyone, regardless of their prior artistic or technical background, engage in the process of ideation. These same tools will enable you to take this or other projects through the remaining stages of design thinking, prototyping, refinement, and the presentation of final solutions. Here is an overview of the solar system to aid in the understanding and exploration phases of the design thinking process. The Sun is the center of our solar system, with all the planets orbiting it. It's over 100 times the diameter of the Earth, making it 10 times larger than the largest planet Jupiter, and has over 1,000 times as much mass as Jupiter. Most of the Sun's mass is made up of hydrogen and helium. The four terrestrial planets are Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars, and are the four planets closest to the Sun. They're generally made up of solids such as rock and metals, unlike the gas giants. Mercury is the closest planet to the Sun, the smallest planet in the solar system, and has the greatest range in surface temperature because of the proximity to the Sun and lack of an atmosphere. While similarly sized as Earth with a similar silicate mantle, Venus features a super-dense atmosphere, almost 90 times as dense as the Earth's, and surface temperatures around 400 Celsius. Earth is the densest of all the planets in the solar system, and is the largest terrestrial planet. Earth's unique concentration of liquid water and free oxygen, along with many other factors, allow it to sustain life. The distance from the Sun to the Earth is used to define a single astronomical unit. Mars is much smaller than Earth in terms of both mass and diameter. It has a thin atmosphere, less than a percent of Earth's, and at one point in time had quite a bit of geological activity. No liquid water has been found on Mars. However, there are two large polar ice caps that contain large quantities of frozen water. The asteroid belt lies between the terrestrial planets and the outer planets. As its name implies, it contains many asteroids and a few larger bodies, such as Ceres the dwarf planet. Most of these asteroids are thought to be made of differing concentrations of rocky and metallic minerals, along with some ice. The outer planets consist of Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Together, the outer planets make up 99% of the mass orbiting the Sun. The largest planet in the solar system is the gas giant Jupiter. It's mainly made up of hydrogen and helium, with no discernible surface. Jupiter is host to at least 67 satellites or moons that have varying characteristics, ranging from concentrations of liquid water to moons larger than Mercury. Saturn shares some similarities with Jupiter, such as being made of mostly hydrogen and helium, but it also has a larger and more pronounced ring. Similarly to Jupiter, Saturn has at least 62 satellites with varying characteristics. While Uranus's atmosphere is chemically similar to Jupiter and Saturn's hydrogen and helium atmosphere, it contains more water, methane, and ammonia, giving Uranus its distinct light blue color. Like Jupiter and Saturn, it also has a ring. However, Uranus orbits the Sun at an angle, so its ring is almost vertical compared to its orbit around the Sun. Additionally, Uranus has the lowest surface temperature of any planet. While Neptune is similarly sized as Uranus, it is the densest of the outer planets and consequently more massive than Uranus. Its atmospheric composition is also similar to that of Uranus, hence its similar coloring. Distances in space are extremely large, so astronomers have created a unit called an astronomical unit. 1 AU is defined as the average distance from the Earth to the Sun, and is slightly less than 150 million kilometers, or over 3,700 times the circumference of the Earth. Mercury, the closest to the Sun, is only 0.4 AU from the Sun, whereas Neptune is a little over 30 AU from the Sun. In the design process, models are used much like tools, where models will aid in the completion of a task. When creating a model, it's important to remember what the task is, as too much or too little detail can detract from a model's effectiveness. Models range from two- or three-dimensional models to physical models or even mathematical models. Neptune was actually discovered via mathematical model in 1846. In the following technical videos, we'll be creating a working 3D model of our solar system depicting the orbits of each planet. This model has many potential uses in the design thinking process, but the main goal for this model is to display the planets of our solar system. You'll make certain decisions during the creation of this model, such as scaling down the sun so the planets are visible and not dwarfed or blocked. We hope that when you've completed modeling our solar system, you'll have a better understanding of how such a model can be created and used in design.